As CBF field personnel serving in Africa and the Middle East, much of my time is spent listening to the stories that represent the worst of humanity. Abuse, violence, war. And the thing I cling to more than any other is the incarnation. God didn't promise us a life without pain, but God did promise to sit with us in that pain. Emmanuel, the incarnate one. I have the great gift to offer this ministry of presence to the folks that I live and serve with here. And I do often get to see healing in tangible ways through the trauma work that we do to offer a glimpse that life might actually be bright again. But I also spend a lot of time sitting with people in the pain that can't be fixed, finding myself on the receiving end of lots of tears, an invitation to offer that divine embrace, perhaps. I embody, to embody, I hope, in some small measure at least, that God is with them, with us both, that neither of us walk this weary world alone. It's the most hopeful thing, really. On the hardest days, the especially heavy ones, I remember, or I try at least, that it's a gift to be the hope bearers. That's the work of the gospel, after all, for all of us, to be people who proclaim that God is with us, even when the world gives us every reason to despair, perhaps especially when the world gives us every reason to despair. We walk as people who know the presence of God among us, weary or not, and that changes everything.